All right, so here's a rental property that we're remodeling. Gonna redo all this flooring, take that load bearing wall out to open it up a bit. Try to make this kitchen a little bit more useful. And then around the corner in the bathroom, uh, redo all that and the door actually hits the vanity when you open it. It's not shown in that video, but I'm gonna move that vanity. All right, about ready to put the shower pan in. I got the vanity water hookups and drain moved. I like to look what's on sale at Lowe's and Home Depot for tile if I have small jobs. Uh, this was only 99 cents a square foot, which is pretty good price. Uh, being a rental property, we wanted to make it tile just so it's a little bit more bomb proof. So I got the cabinets set and ready for countertops. I like to measure them out and just draw a little template. The countertop guy will do his own, but this is just good so he can give me an accurate price before he even comes and measures himself. Here's that load bearing beam. You can actually wrap it with drywall. I like to wrap it with a decorative wood and stain it, finish it, and then it kind of sticks out in the space. And I put these little brackets on uh, for decoration and to hide my seam there in the middle because it was two different pieces. On to the shower. I got the shower pan in and then the waterproof backer board. I used Redguard seam tape on the corners seal that in with mortar. Then I got the sand mix in the shower pan, slope it towards the drain so it makes your tile slope. And I actually made a mistake. I pushed this tile too hard into the mortar when I laid it. And uh, it's, it's kind of squoze up through all the cracks there. And I spent a couple hours scratching it out with the razor blade or else you'd be able to see the gray mortar instead of the black grout. Shit!